Hello, hey everyone. I'm Vivian from Live by Viv. I'm just fixing my bell here, and um, we're gonna be talking about what to wear for Thanksgiving. I am, like I said, Vivian from Live by Viv. I'm a podcaster, blogger, and psychologist. And what I generally talk about is style for curves and midsize. And so we're gonna talk about some different things you could wear for Thanksgiving, kind of depending on what vibe you're going for. You know, if you're going for more um, of a casual vibe or a little dressier, I got some ideas for you. Um, don't forget to click to unmute so you can hear what I'm saying. And also don't forget to follow me here on Amazon so you won't miss any of my notifications of my live. So usually I'm going on Fridays, but I think for the holiday season, I'll probably be doing Saturdays just because the you know weekdays are getting so hectic. So more than likely, you'll see me on um, Saturday nights now for the Saturday Night Live. Um, yeah, and I what I'll do is I'll kind of go through the items and then I'll do a recap. If you have an item you want me to give you more info on and you're like, you saw it on the carousel, and I haven't got to it yet, and you don't have time to sit here for the entire live, just um, on the chat, go and pop in and ask the question, and I'll jump around so that I can answer your questions about the item. Um, I'm gonna put in my sizing. So my sizing is, um, not size, oh, it's like typo here, okay. Sizing is uh, 14, large, um, Excel. Most items here I'm going to share are going to be within that range. Um, most items are Excel, and I am 5'5", uh, five five for those wondering. So, um, yeah, and midsize is, you know, where sometimes I can fit in the straight size stuff. I'm kind of at the top of the straight size, and then sometimes I have to go into the plus size range. Not often, but sometimes. So that's why it's mid-size, so there's that. Okay, let's go ahead and get into it. Um, thank you, Jody Stanton, for following me here on Amazon. Um, you think it's Ian Hess and Khadijah and Dee. Thanks for following me on Amazon. All right, so I'm gonna highlight the first item here. And um, you know what, I haven't been doing dresses a lot or like date night stuff. I was doing more like casual, you know, kind of weekend wear. I feel like my, there we go. Um, kind of uh, items. So I wanted to, you know, kind of go back. I have a ton of dresses, so I wanted to get into sharing these dresses. So this is a long sleeve rouge uh, faux button. Um, not faux button, but it's like, it's not really like button up. The buttons are just there for decor. Um, dress. It's a bodycon dress. Really cute. I think this would be fun for like a friend's giving, you know, if you're looking for more of a sassy vibe. I got it in an XL. It has a ton of rouging. So the rouging was like kind of going up on it. I added my belt. I'm gonna add the belt actually to the live for you guys. Um, Cause I just realized I didn't add it. And it's one of the accessories I use a lot with my, um, with my dresses and my jeans and these belts. Let me get to them and add them here. Okay, it's these right here. Uh, yeah, there we go. Okay, I added them. Um, and I'll just kind of, they, they're in the, I'll highlight them right now for you. So the belt, okay, it's all the way at the end. Okay, so these belts are great because they are size inclusive, meaning that they're gonna fit if you're curvier, they're gonna fit. And they also come in a pack. So I have like uh, this color, a taupey color, white, and then I have black. And then it also comes with a little tool if you want to change, it, like add a hole, you know, for making it smaller or bigger. It's They're great. And they work well with dresses and they work really well with jeans too. And I like that the width, they're not like super wide either, you know? So I think, I feel like they're just like just right. And it's hard to find belts that are simple, that are gonna work for cinching in at the waist for dresses and jeans if you have curves. So I feel like these are, um, worth checking out. Okay, let me go back to this dress though. Okay, so this dress, the price point is great. Um, lots of rouging. I feel like it's very like, you know, kind of um, works with curves very well. And they have them in short sleeve too, the same dress. 
I actually got this dress in black in it with a short sleeve earlier, I would say like the beginning of fall or even just like end of summer. And it's just really cute. So I'm gonna stand up so you can see how it looks. So really cute. You can see the ruching. Um, and like I said, I just added uh, a belt just for, you know, oh, I don't know what's going on with the chat. Was that me? Oh, I don't know what happened. It says ringtone, it's weird. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. Um, uh, yeah, that's really weird. I don't know if you guys see that. Someone's just like typing V. I don't know what's happening. So don't know what's going on. But anyway, so uh, yeah, so I, I like that it's like, you know, form fitting, has lots of rouging, and um, they have it in different colors. I was going to get the long sleeve in black, but I thought it's kind of playing it out, right? If, if I already have it in short sleeve, a short sleeve. Um, and then they have it like in a red too. So great little dress, price point is great. Got it in an XL. So um, if you're a size 14, that should work. I felt like that was just right. If I would have gone up or down a size, I think it only goes up to XL. I think it would have been a little too snug. So I'm gonna keep going. And um, I don't know what's going on with the VVV, but I don't know. <laughs> So the next thing I'm going to share this is a sweater dress. I think the sweater dress could be for like if you want to, you know, have a kind of a low key little look for Thanksgiving. Um, you know, so I love sweater dresses because they're cozy. Um, and then they also at the same time, you know, give you a little little style, you know. So this one I just got. You can see like I have the tag, everything. And I have to kind of play around with the sizing for this one. This one is a size large and it's really cute. It has its own little belt too. So you can do that. And I feel like the belt it comes with is, is it works. So like I don't have to get into that. It says a little belt, really simple little sweater dress. It looks like the way you see it here um, on the, uh, you know, on the, on the product. And I think this is cute, like with just little boots right just really simple and then you can layer with a little coat or whatever but i feel like it looks simple and chic so you can just wear that i might wear this actually for my thanksgiving <laughs> um yeah you can just kind of you know throw this on and then if it's really cold where you are you can also add tights so i think that would be good too just to add you know some um something to keep you warm so yeah so I got this in a, in a large, not an XL. So I did not like go true to size with this one. I sized down a little bit because I didn't want it to be like too loose fitting. Some of these dresses sometimes, like sweater dresses, I see people wearing them and they're like really loose, like oversized. But that, when I do that, it does not work for me. It just looks like a hot mess. So, oh, thanks D Lynch for following me. Um, yeah, so anyway. We're gonna keep going. Um, okay, another sweater dress that's pretty cute, I think would be good for a friend friend's giving is this turtleneck, little mock turtleneck um, mini dress. And it's kind of a thicker sweater material, so it is gonna be pretty warm. They have it in a pretty like camel color. I got the mint color and what I did, I went with um, gray boots that I have that are over the knee. And, um, but I think if, you know, if you're not into this color, <laughs> I always say like, if you're not into the color I'm sharing, go look for like your color. Like if you always start with black, you know, um, go or brown or whatever, go and look for your color. At least you'll know it'll fit, right? For if you're mid-size. So I got it in an XL. I actually got this last season um, and, uh, and it fit a little snug last year when I was a 16. As a 14, I think it fits like right on point. So I would go with an XL if I were you so that you could, you know, it's not um, too loose. I felt like it was like perfect. And then it's not too too snug either. And it is on the shorter side, so that's why I said for Friendsgiving. Um, and I would just go with some boots with it, depending on what color. So I went with the gray, like over the knee boots that I have from Dream Paris that's in my store. And, um, but I think you could do like little lower boots too. And then depending on the color you go with, right? You could do tights, like the other one, tights and some black boots if you went with the black one. So I think it's really cute. This is so soft too. Uh, but keep in mind it is a little thicker. So 
if you have people that, you know, um, like if you're going to be somewhere with a lot of people and it's going to be warm, then that might be a little too much. So yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's keep going. Oh, thanks, Dwayne, 415 for following me here on Amazon. All right. So this is a really popular dress. I'm going to share it. I, I've had this dress, I want to say, for, I don't know, a couple seasons. I think this is one of my like first dresses that I kind of got hip to the Amazon game of <laughs> cute dresses. And um, it's a really just pretty dress. So this one, I know I have friends who've gotten it in black and I feel like it looks really fire up in black. It's a long dress, really comfortable. I got it this really pretty green. It has its own uh, belt too. You can see my like pile of clothes here. <laughs> anyway, um, and I got this one in an XL and I could probably now as a size 14 go a size down. Um, but yeah, it just depends because I know that in the like midsection area, it gets a little snugger. So I don't know. So maybe I would stay with the XL. Um, I feel like you can do like off the shoulder too. I hadn't done that before, but I might do that now. And I just, and it's bat wing too. So that's a pretty detail. And then it has this little like kind of strap in the back. And then it's kind of, it's not going super low. You can wear a standard bra with it. You don't have to worry about that. But just a great dress that, like I, you know, I said, like I've had this for two seasons and, um, you know, it's one that I, I take out again because it's just so pretty. And I love that the sweater material, it's thick enough, but it's at the same time, it's not um, too thick, right? So that you're going to get hot. And I love the length too. The length is like a kind of a midi length sort of thing. So that would work too. Um, you know, so it's like you get that coverage, even though up top is a little less coverage, but it feels still feel like it's pretty modest. All right. Oh, thank you, YL Jackson, for following me here on Amazon. All right, let's keep going to the next item that I have here. So this one is, oh, okay. That one, I just brought it out right here. This could be a Friendsgiving, and this could be a, you know, a Thanksgiving one too, um, just depending on your vibe, right? So this is a also long dress and it's off the shoulder. I have both of these on my storefront, like from the past, there's pictures. So I'll probably take some new ones, you know? <laughs> so um, I like this one because it's ribbed. It's it's a really pretty wine color and it also has, has its own belt too. So I feel like that's real, you know, nice little touch. Um, really, really long, just a pretty dress. And I would go with nude heels. I think that would look really pretty. And um, yeah, so it just depends on your vibe. If your vibe, you wanna be a little more dressed up, this is a good one. And it's stretchy and comfortable, so you can like eat, you know, and relax. Like you don't have to worry about, um, you know, it being too snug in the midsection area when you start to kind of go for what, seconds and thirds? <laughs> so, I don't know, no judgment, you know, whatever. So anyway, so that one is, um, and I got this one in an XL as well, and that rhymes. All right, let's go to this next one here. So this is a really pretty, kind of a cardigan style dress. Um, I feel like this could be a Thanksgiving dress too, doesn't have to be Friendsgiving. And I think now, I got this in an XL. I think now, like, I would probably, for me, I'd add a belt, but you don't have to. Um, it's mini length, and I like that it has a slit down the front. The buttons are faux buttons like this one, so they're not going to open up, which I feel like is good, you know? <laughs> so, um, But it's a cardigan style dress. I got it in this blue. They have it in black. I think the black... It would look fire, especially for those of you who like to wear black first, that's kind of your go-to color, then I think you'd be good with it. Um, and it's it's ribbed too, and not super thick. So this one, and then it has like tiny buttons too, so I kind of like that, tiny buttons all the way down, you know? So it's nice. So that one, 
And what did I do with the, yeah, I also did a pair of nude heels with this one. I felt like that looked good, um, you know, with the, with the blue. So, so check it out and see, you know, if you want to go with a black color, that would look really nice too. Um, but it's just a great dress and it fits really well. Oh, Susie Valentin, Valentin said, that's cute. Thanks, Susie, for following me. Yeah, it's really cute. And I feel like, I mean, it's just like a dress that you can wear um, just throughout the season. So I try to get stuff that isn't like holiday specific because then it's like you only wear it for like, okay, I want to wear it, you know, once a year. It's like, what the heck? So it's going to take up space in your closet. So I try to get stuff that I know I will want to wear again and I can wear in different ways. Um, you know, kind of dress up or dress down type of thing. Uh, so that there's more, you get more use out of it and it's not just like sitting in your closet waiting for a special occasion for you to wear it. So yeah, so yeah, Su Susie Valentine said exactly, yes. Yeah. So okay, I have another one that is similar to that green one. Actually, I have two of these. So I'm gonna share both. Okay, so this one, and this is a popular dress on Amazon, similar to the other one. This is a little bit more sassy because it is shorter, and um, but it's not too bad, you know? So if you wanted to wear this for Thanksgiving and change it up, this is what I would do to make it more kind of holiday-ish. I went with the bold red lip. That I think it looks so good against this powder blue. Um, so you can do that. I think that looked like fire. And then it has its little, um, you know, uh, little, my gosh, belt. <laughs> um, I got it in XL and just looks good. I think XL is perfect because the bottom part is a little more snug. So if I would have gone down a size, even since I, I'm not, I was 16 now, 14, I think it'll be too snug. So this is perfect. Um, and it has that bat wing kind of style right here. It's a wrap style really cute and i just like the color is really pretty so i'm gonna go and uh, show you the next one. Oh, thank you linda Sounder sounders for following me on amazon all right let's go to the next one here so i'll put this one here it's getting out of control all right so it's the same dress you just saw but in red so this one so this is my thing with red. I like red. Um, you know, red's a commitment though, because then you gotta like, for me, you gotta put the red lipstick on, right? Uh, I mean, you don't necessarily, but I feel like it just looks better. And then dress the makeup really clean. So, um, so maybe I'll do a live where I like talk about red stuff so I can share my red lipsticks I like. So this is the same one, but you can see how bold, like this is a very vibrant red. And um, so this is gonna be like a holiday vibe, but this is my thing with red. So you can get, get red dresses that are really simple, right? Everything else, the color is bold, but everything's simple. So you can wear it for Valentine's Day or when you just wanna wear a red dress. So it doesn't seem like super like Christmas or holiday vibe, because then you won't be able to wear it the rest of the year. I mean, you could if you want to, but you just won't. It'll seem kind of like, what's she wearing, you know? So that's what I do. I go like, if I get red, get it very bold, but then the rest of the design of the dress, very simple. Um, and then, you know, and I like this kind of red. I feel like this looks good on like my complexion. So that's why I go with something bold. And then I have a lip color from MAC that's on my storefront, Lady Danger. And that one's just like good stuff. You know, Lady Danger, another one's quite the standout. So those are the two lip colors I go with um, when I'm wearing like red. You know, so it's, I mean, it's like crazy. Like, look how bright it looks. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna put that here. All right. Oh, um, do, oh, Mandy is asking, does the strap go in the back or the front? The strap goes in the back. So the back and the front, in essence, are kind of the same, right? So this is the back here. Let's see, yeah. So this is the front right here. And then this is the back. So you would see it in the back. So that's pretty if you like put your hair up, you know, or pulled it back and then you see that in the back. I feel like that's nice. Okay, I have the belt on the floor, but that's okay. Um, oh, Mama4, thanks for following me. Red looks great on you. I bet you look pretty in red lipstick. Thanks, Mama4. Yeah, so I'm gonna, I think I'll do one like all red because then it'll like get you ready for Valentine's Day. 
So I love that. I like that January to February time where it's like you can just kind of refresh and you don't have, you know, there's not all these expectations of you. <laughs> and you can get into red. So I think we'll do something like that. Um, but in the meantime, you can go to my storefront to see the red cut lip colors that I'm um, into that I'm like, I like and have worked. Okay, so this is another like, maybe friends giving vibe again. You know, I'm low key and probably gonna go with that black dress I shared earlier for um, Thanksgiving because I just do low key. Uh, my parents live five minutes away. We just go for a bit and they're like, all right, you know, you know what I mean? So some people you're like going far away or whatever, or you haven't seen people in a while, or maybe you're just doing stuff with friends. So anyway, this dress is pretty fire. I have it also in like a brown rusty color and um, it's one of my best sellers. It's crazy. So. I think like, cause I made a video maybe two years ago, I think with the one that's like the brown color and it's just been a, like a best, like that videos, um, like people buy the dress, <laughs> so I don't know. Anyway, but this um, is a very just simple black kind of off the shoulder. You can wear it the standard way if you want to, but off the shoulder, it looks like it wouldn't fit, right? It looks like it's a scarf right now, but it's very stretchy, it's ribbed, and see, you see how it stretches out. I got an XL. I did try to get adventurous and get a nude color and get it in a large, um, I don't know, maybe two months ago, and that did not work. So let's go with the XL and let's stay with the black and then the brown. Like when I got that one, I'm like, oh, this doesn't look right. I don't know. It just wasn't, it wasn't a, a good match for me. So this one is definitely a little fire dress. You know, and some of the stuff that I'm sharing, you could also be like gearing up for holiday parties and things like that. And I like when it's a sweater type dress, so you're gonna stay warm depending on where you're gonna be if you're outside or if you know, like you're in an area that's just generally colder because I'm in the Los Angeles area. Okay, okay, so let's go into, get into this other sweater dress. So if I wasn't gonna wear the black dress, I think I would do this one. Maybe this one could be a Christmas dress. This could be a good like holiday um, postcard, you know, the cards, the pictures. I haven't done them in years. What I started doing was like um, when my kids were younger, because I have a 20 year old and then an 11 year old. So we used to, I used to take them to the park and then like take pictures of them playing in the park. And then that was, that's the card <laughs> right there. But I know people, it's a to do for a lot of, a lot of folks. So this could be a really good kind of holiday photo dress. If you don't like this color, you can tell I like olive. I like green because I have it all over. Um, this one, you can get it in black or I think you, I don't know what other colors. I know it's black, but I don't want to say one color and it's not there. I got it in XL. It has its own belt. It has ribbing and a faux wrap in the front. And then it kind of has a different kind of ribbing. And then what I like is this little kind of, you know, roughly flute vibe at the hem. I like that. So it's really pretty. Just kind of very girly dress and um, it's sufficient coverage for a family photo and for like a family kind of Thanksgiving vibe. So um, you can consider this one. And then again, look and see if they have a color you like, right? So that you know it fits, right? Um, a size 14. But um, you can find the color that kind of, you know, makes you uh, happy, which one works with your, your palette, okay, for your wardrobe. And then I have this shirt dress. So this um, is not too sassy, could be a Friendsgiving. And um, it has real buttons, has rouging all the way down the middle. It's very comfortable and like, yeah, really stretchy. I've worn it for one of the lives. I have to just do, I haven't done like images with it, but I love like, yeah, there's like kind of rouging. Yeah, there's rouging on the sleeves too. It's just a nice little dress that you can pair it with boots and then layer with a little overcoat. And then, you know, you arrive to your Thanksgiving event and you take it off, you know, <laughs> your little overcoat. Um, so really cute, got it in an XL. They have it in black as well. I think they have it in like a nude color too. But I think for this one, I would go with like the darker colors. I feel like it kind of, you know, just works better with the dress, in my opinion, compared to the lighter colors. 
So I should show you, I'm like showing you guys the back, so I should show you the front. Yeah, so it's cute. I like this little collar. I feel like it's a little nod to like the 70s vibe shirt dress, you know, energy here. Um, I did add a belt, so I think that kind of just adds a little bit more structure. You don't have to if you're not into that, but um, I did and I felt like that worked well. So, okay, let's go to the next one here. Okay, so I'm kind of like, now switching into some more casual things. I have this poncho that I just got. Okay, this is out of control here. Okay, here we go. Okay, so I got this poncho recently and um, you can see the tags here. And I like that. First of all, it's really soft. I like that. But I like that you can kind of like take the front and um, I think it shows it on there. There's like this little loophole here. So I would do like a black turtleneck, a mock turtleneck. There's ones um, that I have on my storefront. So um, yeah, so I would, you can do that. So you have this little knot thing here and then you loop it through. Isn't that so cute? So definitely like something different. But I like that there might be, you know, uh, you want to maybe have a Thanksgiving where you're going to be more cash. You want to be more co comfy and cozy. Or maybe there's people who like, you know, like you go to some houses. I don't have this problem, but you go to some houses and they have like the AC going or something. It's just like super, you know, cold in their house. Like what the heck? You know, so this can be your little like blanket. Um, like on, I think it was Halloween, like I was outside a lot, I'm always cold. So I had my scarf, I was ready to go. So I could just like, you know, everyone's like, are you okay? I'm like, yeah. Yeah, so that's that's the answer is just have this really cute poncho. And, um, and I think I'll be like rocking this to work too. But it's really chic too, it's just like simple, you know, design. So we're gonna put it up here, okay. Oh, thank you Taylor for following me here on Amazon and Tiffany team. All right, then I found this sweater. I think it's really cute. Let me see if I can find it in here. Okay. Sorry. Okay. So um, it's just a cute sweater to wear with the pair of jeans. It's a little bit like, not cropped, but it's going to hit right at the waist. And so you're gonna to wanna to go with some high-waisted jeans. But this might be something I wear too, and then just little boots, and then you're good to go. Um, I like the way this sweater feels, and it's just really simple. It's kind of this, It's I think it's an apricot color. It's kind of a pinky color. So I think I'm gonna order um, like a black or a brown, because I feel like it's a great sweater just to throw on um, with a pair of jeans. I have boot cut jeans I'm sharing that are from Levi's. Oh, and I got this in an XL. No, 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 I got in a large. I got in a large and I felt like it was perfect. So yeah, I gotta remember, cause I'm so used to everything I get is in an XL. So yes, large. <laughs> so just wanna make sure I give you the right information. And I felt like it hit just perfectly. Um, you know, it fit perfectly, it wasn't too big. And I, I like the color, I feel like it's something different. So, so let me show you what my game plan is to wear the, the um, sweater is these jeans from Levi's. So if you've been following me on Amazon, if you haven't, you should. <laughs> so I haven't been asking you guys to do that. I've been just like yippee up or whatever. Um, because if you've been following me on my, and watching my lives, you know that I talk a lot about like this situation of trying to find jeans for curves. I feel like it's really difficult to find jeans for curves that actually fit. So Levi's, I just got hip to Levi's and I saw that they're really popular at Amazon. So I'm like, okay, I wanna give them a try. And um, I now I know why. So I have like no joke, I think like four pairs now of Levi's. I started getting them about three months ago. So you can see now my storefront, this is a new pair I just got. Um, this is the rib cage boot cut. I got in a 32. I already have it in a lighter wash. Um, I'll probably get it darker, even darker. This is like a kind of a medium wash. So I have, I would go with these. They're great, they're high-waisted, they feel good on, they look good on. And these are boot cuts, that's kind of fun too. 
you know, so you can wear little boots and your sweater. So perfect, right? And it's some little jewelry or something, little stacks of your bracelets. And I think you're good to go and then just have your little jacket and you're perfect for your th Friendsgiving or Thanksgiving, depending on how dressy your situation is. Or maybe just you're going out and doing some stuff with friends because you they're in town or people have some time and you're gonna go get some coffee or whatever, or matcha. Um, yeah, so yeah, Levi's, I'm into it. And a size 32 is just right. And um, so keep in mind though, with these like rib cage boot cut jeans, there is um, less stretch. I have some flares and that those have more stretch in them. These have a little less stretch, but I feel like there's more structure and there's not, they're not gonna stretch out as much, right? So you wanna try to get close enough to your size so that you can like feel comfortable in them. And then they loosen up a bit, but they're just not as stretchy as some other jeans that I own. So that's this one and okay oh yeah this is a cute sweater also can be like you know friendsgiving i have this is my second one i just got it recently it's a sweetheart neckline really cute and um and then it has like kind of gathers in the middle right there so last year i got the same one in an xl but got it like in a maroon color and it looked great but now it's too big for me, so this one's a size large. And I just wanted to get pink. So <laughs> it's not like a holiday color or whatever, but I just wanted my pink. And um, yeah, that's what I'm doing. And then this will be good though. Think about like February when it's pinks and reds. This is gonna be really cute to wear, or just wear it now, but I'm just saying. So a cute sweater, and then it's gonna go right here, right? So you're gonna wanna go with high-waisted bottoms. They have them all have the um, sweater in all kinds of colors, so you can get um, like I said, like a kind of maroon burgundy color. They have it in black. They have it in blue, gray. So whatever your kind of go to color is for your um, wardrobe, your palette, then you'll find it um, there. So, all right, let's go to the next thing. So I'm thinking, okay, like what kind of you know shoes you want to rock with these dresses or the what I'm gonna probably wear with a little black sweater dress. So I think last live I shared these boots from Dream Paris that were, were the same as these, but they were like kind of a cream color. Well, I need to take that out actually. Okay, all right, so, so I like these. I feel like these are gonna work really well with some of the more casual sweater dress dresses um, and I like that it has kind of this little sock thing too. They're really comfortable. Let me tell you. <laughs> so I've been trying to get, like I, I bought a bunch of boots on Amazon and then I try them on and I there's some that I'm like, I love the way they look, but if they're not comfortable, I'm not gonna keep them. I'm not gonna, I, I return them because I'm not gonna wear them. And then I don't wanna share them with you all and you guys are like, what is this? What is, what is she doing? So these are really comfortable and I love that they have this little kind of, sock type you know thing here and i think they'll look good with more of the casual stuff that i shared and then i have i'm pointing to the other ones that are in the room too that are kind of this like cream color and i like that you can clean them you know so i mean you could even do like leggings turtleneck this uh the poncho and then these boots i think that would look really cute or that sweater dress that i shared earlier this black one that has the little fabric belt and some tights, I think that would look really, really cute too. I think that's the vibe I'm gonna go for on Thursday. So it's comfortable, but it looks like I'm trying, you know, so just a little bit of effort. Um, so oh, I think there's someone on the chat, let me see. What's the brand from the pink sweater? Oh yeah, let me highlight it for you. It is um, Pretty Garden, that's the brand. Yeah, Pretty Garden, and I got this one in a large. So I'm gonna take the tag off. I don't wanna rip it off here and then I rip the tag live and like the tag of, you know, I've done stuff like that or I don't know. So <laughs> I was like, just cut them off. I'm like, I just rip it off. And then finds he finds them on the floor of the tags. He's like, okay, chick. So, and it's a sweetheart neckline, just real cute little sweater. And then the little rouging in the front and it goes up a little bit, but I feel like it's sufficient coverage. If you have high-waisted um, jeans, you're good to go. So. I uh, hope that answers um, your question. That was Jimbo. 
Jimbo. Oh, thank you, Mildred Lopez, for following me. Natalie C., Hannah Stewart, and Vipra. Thanks for following me here on Amazon. Um, so those are the boots that I just shared. And you can see they have quite a few reviews. So it's over um, 1,300 reviews. Oh, okay, the pink sweater that I shared. Oh, yeah, yeah, I know what you're talking about. It's actually, Jimbo said the pink sweater from earlier. It's pink queen. So that one. Yeah, because it's kind of like a dusty pink, right? So it's this one, and this one I got in a large, and um, it's cute. It's just really cute little sweater. So I think that's the one you were talking about. And it's uh, pink queen, and then this one's pretty garden, but you're, you were talking about the other one. Okay, so let me put this one back. There you go. Yeah, so that's the one right here. It's highlighted, okay? All right, I'm gonna go to the next thing. Okay, so let's say, Thanksgiving, you're like, I'm not gonna do anything, or you're just gonna be low key, and you don't wanna, but you don't wanna look like totally sloppy, right? You wanna, you wanna look like you're, you got your put together a bit. So I have the answer for you. This little lounge set, I, I shared this last week in my live, and then I think I just put it on my storefront. If I haven't already, I think there'll be images. It's so cute, so it's a wide leg lounge set. It's ribbed and, um, okay, stay, okay. So it's a top and the top is gonna hit kind of, you know, right at the waist. Why is it, okay, <laughs> right at the waist. Long sleeve, really comfortable. I got an XL and I felt like that was just right. And then the pants are high-waisted, but not too high. And they're wide leg. They're just awesome. It's just a really cute little set. So um, you can like, you know, follow me here on Amazon and then you'll see I put images and videos um, on my storefront. The videos that I put, I'll have like a voiceover of me reviewing it, you know, I like it. And then whenever I post like the video or the picture of the item, an image with wearing it, styling it, I'm gonna put the sizing on there so that it'll help you kind of figure out because sometimes some things I get a large, some things I get an XL, just kind of depends um, on the fit. And there's times where I do a couple like return and then I you know, try to get a different size. If I really like the style and I wanna see if it's gonna work, I'll do that a bit. So you don't have to do that, right? So you could just um, go on my storefront and then you can see you know, what, what uh... sorry the other you showed earlier, I love it, thanks. Which one are you talking about? Wait, hold on. Jimbo's saying the pink sweater I shared earlier. Let me see if there's another pink sweater. I think that's it. Oh, you said thanks. Okay, I thought she was asking another one. I'm like, wait a minute. Anyway, so um, so yeah, I think these lounge the lounge set too. If brown's not your thing, I've been into brown for a while now. But they have black, they have cream, they have blue. So you can go and check it out and then you get the color that works for you. And I think it's cute. So I feel like Thanksgiving Day, you know, if you're cooking and stuff and you don't want to look like straight up, you know, you want to look like put together, but you still want to be comfortable, use this lounge set, you know. And I, I actually, like, I'm going to wear it to go out and run errands too, you know. <laughs> Just put your little Ugg boots on, you're good to go. Oh, thanks, Ski, for following me, and Jimbo. Jimbo, thanks for following me. Okay, and then my purse, which is behind me. So I was really debating on which purse should you use for Thanksgiving for some of these dresses and stuff I was sharing. This is gonna be a good one, why? Because there's actually like room in it for you to have like your real stuff. Like if you're gonna be somewhere for hours, you know, and it's not like you're going out to dinner and things like that, but you're at someone's house or whatever. You want to have a purse that's functional. Um, so this one will work. It has like little compartments too, zipper pouch in the middle. Um, and I like that the color, they also have it in black. And I might get it in black because now I'm thinking like for some of these holiday things, a lot of people will want black. But this is a great kind of tone to start with because it'll match with a lot of different things, including black. It won't look bad with it, but it can be a crossbody, right? Or it can be a handbag, just the way, it depends on how you wanna wear the chain. But really pretty little purse that, you know, like I'll show you with my phone. Um, 
see. So that's that's a good amount of room. And I can put my wallet in here and that sort of thing. Okay, let's make sure it's not gonna fall. I have my books there. I don't know. I probably need to change it up, make it look more holiday now. <laughs> So thanks, Doreen, for following me. All right, so let's get into some jewelry. This is the necklace I'm wearing. It's an initial necklace, V for Vivian. And um, I feel like this could be a good gift. I have, this is my second initial necklace from Amazon. I have another one that's a little like circle pendant and then it has the initial. But whenever I wear these, I always get compliments. So I feel like it'd be a good little gift. You know, like I had, I've been mentioning this forever. Like if it's a bridal party, you know, you want to give a gift to your, your bridal party or something, or you want to give a gift, like a collection of few things, this would be a cute little thing to put in there. And people like when it's personalized. Like I have a mug that says V on it, and I always use it just because it's like, it feels like they took an extra moment to get me something that's for me. And then, so I would do this and maybe like, depending on what the person's into, like a little tumbler, like for coffee, um, things like that. So that I probably should, I'm gonna put together a gift guide on like stuff for like, you know, like people that you're like, I wanna get them something and I wanna get something like, you know, really huge, but you wanna just show like, hey, I was thinking about you in the holidays. So some this will be one that I think would be good. Oh, hey Doreen, uh, thanks for following me on Amazon too. And then these are a great little pair of earrings. They're hoops. I like that they look like they're heavier and more substantial than they actually are. They're, you know, lightweight, but they look good. And they, you know, add a little bling uh, without being too much. I think they work too when you're gonna like wear something to go out, but you want it to be a little classy. I feel like these work really well. I know my hair kind of engulfs them, but whatever. So, um, and you can see, oh my gosh, it's like 4,100 or no, 41,000, sorry, um, reviews. It's almost five stars. All right. So let's get into some makeup, just sharing a few things. So I'd be really careful. This is Charlotte Tilbury. I have it on right now. It's the bronzer. It's the airbrush bronzer. So I, um, I just like the case too. I think it's so pretty, you know, so anyway, anyway, so this is the color and I just put it on like I have it on now. I think it just adds a nice glow um, and it's not overbearing. I was a little worried when I first was like, okay, I want to try a bronzer. I don't know how it's going to go on my skin. Like if it's going to look too like harsh or, you know, or too like obvious, but it's great. It looks really smooth on and it just adds just a little bit of dimension to your, um, your makeup. And I got, the color I got was, mm, oh, and it's a three tan, three tan is the color I got for the Charlotte Tilbury. Okay. All right. So let's go to the next one. Okay. So, and so this is my brow pencil, my go-to one from Anastasia. So I use this pretty much every day and it's one of those items I am for sure refilling, right? So I like that it comes with a little brush so you can kind of, you know, fix your brows, that sort of thing. And then I like that, um, and also when you wanna fill in your brows, it's really soft. So it has a kind of a, you know, slanted um, point there you can see. And then it's just really soft when you wanna like just fill in your brows. So I don't have, really like substantial brows, but it helps me just kind of fill them in. I got the color um, chocolate and that's been, the, it's perfect. It's like just not too much, really easy to control. And I like that it comes on soft without being too like thick or looking too like obvious. So it's a good little kind of like everyday makeup. So these are things that I put on every day. Okay, and then the other thing here is, um, it's a matte finish from NYX. So really popular. Make sure you guys can see it. So it's a finishing spray and I'll just show you how it looks or how to do it. I just, I, I sometimes if I'm really like on it, I'll be putting on my makeup. And then, cause I remember watching something, you know, you watch those tutorials and they're like, 
you could put your finishing spray, your setting spray in between, like as you're like almost halfway done too. Um, so when I'm on my game, I do that. But other times I just do at the end, just do a nice spray and it just like sets my makeup. Also just feels like refreshing, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, but I like it just to kind of keep my makeup in place. And the stuff that I'm sharing, I put it on in the morning and then wear it to work and I don't have to worry about it. Like, you know, so all the makeup I'm sharing kind of, it works for um, my skin's like more sensitive and then also a little bit more oily and it's like not all sliding all over the place. I did do something the other day that I'm like, I'm not doing it again. I did use a serum a day, in the daytime instead of night, a thousand under my makeup. That did not work. It just was like oily with oily. So not gonna do that again. Oh, thank you Amazon customer for following me. So the last thing I shared was, or I added was this belt because it wasn't there before. So I already talked about it. It's just a great belt for cinching at the waist or jeans and they have all kinds of different colors. You can see it's almost five stars over 4,000 reviews, and they come in sets of two or three. So keep that in mind. So I have like three black belts because I wanted different colors, and black is typically included in the set. And um, what I like is that it's size inclusive, you know? So it's gonna fit if you're curvier, um, whereas a lot of belts, like when I was like 16, 18 size, I couldn't find a belt that would fit. So this one, fit me and so still into it oh amazonian <laughs> look your name said i uh, love your outfit thank you so much oh thank you raymond for following me all right let's do a quick recap let me know if you have any questions about any of the items so this is the dress i'm wearing and they have it also in black i was sharing earlier i have the one in black that's a short sleeve because they have short and long sleeve um, and I almost got this one again in black too, but I thought, okay, like let's let's be a little more creative. <laughs> um, I like that it has a lots of lots of rouging all the way down and in the back. And rouging's great because rouging is going to kind of um, kind of give you more coverage. And um, you know, we always like that. And I like that it's kind of ribbed as well, and it's like a little faux cardigan dress. Um, but the buttons are not functional, they're just there, which I like. So you don't have to worry about it opening up or gaping or any of those um, things that make it hard to just wear an outfit, you know. So really cute little bodycon um, situation there. I got it in an XL. And then I was just sharing this dress. So it comes in different colors too. And the hot take on this one for the recap is that I was sized down. So. An XL, I think, would be a little too like baggy for me, for my taste. So I went with the large, and then it comes with its own little fabric belt. Um, and I'm probably gonna wear this dress with these boots here. I think that'll be cute. And some tights for Thanksgiving. So kind of low key, but cute, you know? So I think that's what I'm gonna do. Um, okay, next one was this mini dress. So the hot take on this one is it's a little bit thicker. It is, it's, I guess it's on the shorter side too. So this might be a Friendsgiving type of vibe, depending on what, I don't know. You know, maybe Thanksgiving you're cool, you know, doing like shorter, but might be a Friendsgiving. And they have it in this cream color too, like a camel color. You've probably seen this dress before too. So it's cute and um, really like soft and stretchy. And I got it in XL. I feel like an XL is on point for a 14 too, um, because when I was a size 16 is when I got it, but I, I feel like it's gonna be too snug if I were to go down to a large. And I just went with some over the knee boots that were great and I felt like they looked, it looked perfect with that. So you can do that. Um, this next one. Okay, these dresses, uh, here's the green one. Okay, so these dresses are great because they're comfortable, they're um, soft, and I like too that it's a different style, you know? So the strap goes in the back, because the front and the back pretty much are the same. It's a faux wrap style, midi length, 
really pretty green too. I mean, look at this green, this pretty. So this is more like, I think holiday. So the first time I wore this, I wore with like a pair of gold heels. I felt like it looked so pretty. And then a really bold red lip, you know? But you could also like tone down the lip. You don't need to do a red lip, but I like the gold accessories up against the green. So like if you see the gold here, it just looks so pretty. So that one, and it has a bat wing sleeve too. So um, just a nice little detail. You can go off the shoulder or you can go standard. I wore it usually the standard way. I'm having trouble kind of folding it up, okay. <laughs> so, um, but you can do off the shoulder if that's your vibe. And then um, this other one I was sharing. This one, the hot take on that one is that it is off the shoulder. And um, I think, you know, you can do for Thanksgiving. It's not too sassy. I think it's it should be fine. Um, and I like that it has its own belt. So it has its own belt. So that makes it easy. I like when there's um, like items that make it just really easy. Just throw it on, and then you could just put a little pair of heels, and you're you, boom, you're done. You know, versus some things where you're like, oh, okay, I gotta get all this stuff. So yeah, it's just really easy, and it's ribbed, and it's not super thick. So if you're inside and you're going to be with, you know, like it's warmer inside, you're going to be fine. So, right. And I like that it's a longer dress. So that's kind of nice too. Okay. This was a cardigan dress. So with this one, I was just saying like, I feel like it's not even like a holiday specific type dress. It's a really pretty dress. So you could just, you know, pair with the uh, nude heels, I think would look good. And I went with an XL but they do have it in black and some other colors. It's just a really like basic, but pretty dress because the way it fits and then it's ribbed, but it's not like too thick. And um, I went with an XL, but you can get another color if you don't want the blue. I felt like the blue was a little bit different for me too, so. Okay, and then these dresses, I already talked about them. So the, the main thing with them is that um, I would I went with an XL. I would not go to a large as, as a 14 because the midsection is a little more snug. So that's, you know, you want to have some room there. Same with the red one. And then this one, it's really stretchy. When you pull it out, like to, of the package when you get it, you're like, it's not gonna fit me. But it will, it'll stretch out. And it's been one of my best sellers. I have it like in a brown color. So, and it's really like more of a longer dress. And then this green one is Kind of like, uh, I think the perfect dress if you're going to be doing like family photos um, because it's like a really pretty like cut, but also the color is really rich. But you could also do another color that's like your thing. I got it in Excel. And then this one I felt like was more um, of Friendsgiving vibe. And I would add a belt with this one. And I got it in Excel. Then we were talking about this poncho. That's so cozy. <laughs> So, and then this was the sweater that Jimbo was asking about. Um, got this one in a large, which was different than most. And uh, these Levi jeans, like I'm into them now. I, I, yeah, I'm, it's my fourth pair of jeans. And um, I think once I figured out my size, that's what was like, okay, now I'm good. And I like that so far with Levi's, when I like the size, I don't have like an issue where I go to a different style and then it doesn't fit. You ever have to have that happen? So annoyed. So I've been like, okay, go with 32 and um, and we're good. And it just, it fits. So I'm really excited about that. Oh, thank you, Laura, for following me. And then this was the Sweetheart Neckline pink sweater. Really cute. I think we'll be good too once we hit February when it's like reds and pinks. And then these boots, my second pair. So I have those like cream colored ones that are over here. And then these and they're low and comfortable. I think these would look good with leggings too and just everything. So I like my little leggings. And then finally, this was the um, MVP here, <laughs> the loungewear set that is wide leg pants and it comes in different colors, got it in XL. And I think it'll be one that if you don't use it for like Thanksgiving during the holiday season, I think when you're gonna like run an errand real quick, a grocery run or something, or go out, you can like wear this out, but also you can have it at home and still look put together, you know? I like having like loungewear that like is, you know, 
kind of like a set or something like that. So you look kind of put together, even that, that while you're you know at home. We don't need to look sloppy just because we're home. Um, all right. Oh, thank you, Nicole H., for following me. And then we already went into these other things, the other accessories and makeup. Um, and I think that's pretty much it. So I'm going to start to sign off. Um, don't forget to follow me here on Amazon because now we're going to get ready for Black Friday. I already am prepping on some things I want to share that I want you to jump on to get. Um, oh, oh, wait. Okay. I don't know. So, okay. Got to hide that uh, last comment there. Um, so make sure you follow me on Amazon so that you won't miss notifications of when I'm going live. And you will also be able to get updates on my storefront because I'm going to be putting more content on there. And this will be like the go-to place for getting some of your fashion deals for Black Friday. And then uh, let's see what else. So let me go ahead and sign off. And I wanted to say thank you, Jody, for following me, Ian, Khadija D. And I think it was Jimbo, too. Thanks for following me, um, D. Lynch, Dwayne, Y.L. Jackson, Susie Valentine, Linda Souders, Mama Four, Taylor, thanks for following me on Amazon, Tiffany, Natalie, Hannah Stewart, uh, Vipra, Mildred Lopez, Ski, Jimbo, Doreen, thanks for following me, Raymond, and then Raina, um, and Nicole H. and Laura, thanks for following me here on Amazon. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.